Hey everybody, it's Cody Game! Welcome to my new Let's Play of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Blue Rescue Team for the Nintendo 3... Fuck, I almost said that. For the Nintendo DS. I'm gonna be using an emulator to play it, as this is the best way to do it for me. And uh, I'm gonna have the more important screens on top and the less important screens on the bottom. Right now, that would be on top. So, of course, we're going to start a new game. Welcome. This is a portal that leads to the world of Pokemon. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry, guys. Mm, off. All right. But before I can let you through, I have several questions for you. You must solve my three... I'm the grumpy old... I don't want to start that. Anyway, I want you to answer them sincerely. Are you ready? Okay. Let's interview... Let the interview begin. There's a person you like, but there's no opportunity to get close. What do you do? Um... Uh. Damn it, I had to get this one first. I'll tell you what, I'll do this. I didn't even know what I did. Do you consider yourself to be a dull and overly, and overly cautious? I went on YouTube, took a big shot in that, so I'm gonna say no. There's a bucket. If you put water in it, how how you fill it? Bro, Macho Man Randy Savage, all the way. A delinquent is hassling a girl on a busy city street. What do you do? Bro, help without hesitation. I'm a brave guy. Do you like to imagine things for your amusement? Fuck yes. What, do you feel loneliest when you aren't alone? Not really, not much anymore. I mean, if I'm alone, I'll just do recordings for you guys. Sorry if I sounds like I got a stepped up nose. I kinda got a plugged up nose. Uh, not really. Can you sincerely thank someone when you're feeling grateful? Yeah. A human animal extends out of the toilet. What would you do? Uh, <laughs> just close the lid without a word. Really. Are you a boy or a girl? I am a boy. You appear to be the hearty type. You do your homework diligently and you know how to eat proper. I'll take two out of three. I'll take one out of two. You have a strong willpower that lets you complete tasks, however, though. However tough. Uh, one out of three. You can also be stubborn to the point of even feuding with friends. Okay, two out of four. Nothing will go right for you when you're in irritated, so learn to laugh it off. A hearty person like you should be the Pokemon Charmander. Hey! That's pretty cool. I kind of got the one I wanted. This is the final step. Who would you like to have as a partner? Choose from the Pokemon you want your partner to this group. So we have the other starters. We have Bulbasaur, Squirtle, Pikachu, Chikorita, Totodile, Trico, and Mudkip. But you noticed something. Did you guys see it? Cyntaquil and Torchic are not here. They won't let you pick a, star a partner of the same type. So you want to cover all your bases. Now, being a fire type, I have a risk of being hit by water attacks. But I am also super effective against grass. So it stands to reason, I want to pick a Pokemon that will back up my uh, weaknesses. And what better Pokemon can I think of than Trico? And, uh... We'll just call him Trico, because this is supposed to be the Pokemon world. Okay, we're all set. Let's get you into the world of Pokemon. Go for it! Where am I? Am I dreaming this? I feel a pleasant breeze. I hear a voice from somewhere. I wonder who it is. Excuse me. Please, wake up. Come on, wake up. Oh, my head. Oh, you're finally awake. Great. Where is this? Huh? You were passed out here. Glad to see you were awake. I'm Trico. Glad to meet you. And you are? I've never seen you around here before. Huh? You're a human. That's a weird way to start a fucking conversation, but knowing me, I'd do it. But you look like a normal Charmander in every way. What the fuck you talking about, Trico? Oh... It's true, I've turned into a Charmander. Okay, that's not what freaks you out. The Trico in front of you is talking. But no, uh, the fact being you're a Charmander, that freaks you out. Okay, sure. But why? I, I don't remember anything. 
Um, you're kind of weird. Your name? What's your name? <sighs> my name? That's right, my name is... Dickface. No, my name is Cody. Fuck. I'm not Cody Bieber. God, no, that'd be like... I'd ask people to... I, no. Damn it! Come on. This is hard to do in a small, tiny touchscreen. My name is, of course, Cody. Oh, Cody's your name. Well, it's a funny name. Yeah, I know your pain. <laughs> Somebody, please help me. Oh, what's going on? I hear shouts from over there. Why? What's wrong? It's horrible. My cat had to be fell into a cavern. My poor baby. What? A huge fissure opened in the ground, and my caterpie fell in. He's too young to crawl by crawl by himself. When I went to get to, when I while I went to get my when I went to go get my baby, Pokemon suddenly attacked me. Huh? You were attacked? Do I hear the Pokemon? They must be enraged at the, by the fissure and out of control. That's what I think. But I'm not strong enough to fend off those wild Pokemon. What will become of my baby? Oh, what am I to do? Oh dear, oh dear. This sounds bad. We have to go help. So, starts the first journey in the world of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. Head for the destination while attacking foes with the A button. Try not to let a partner faint. Alright, so the point of this game is... It is... If you guys have ever played chess, to me, it, remi it reminds me of a game of chess. Poke is the money, or I just call it coin. I just call it gold. Poke gold is the money that is in this world. Collect and save it to buy useful items. So, right now, I guess we could go over our menus and our stats. We have moves. Currently, as you would probably expect a Charmander, we only have Growl and Scratch. Trico, Leer, and Pound. Right now, we can only hold one item apiece. And on our team, we'll go over teams a little later. We have options, which I actually think I'm going to fiddle with. Uh... Fast, far off pals, uh, damage, turn, grids, <sniffs> display mode. Can I turn? What? Top screen, team data, bottom screen. Uh, team data, clear map. Team data and shaded map. Uh, I guess we'll just keep uh, changing the settings. Yep. All right. So with that, we, we now move a little faster in the dungeon, which is good because I don't like going. But you hold down B and you go much faster. Go to stairs to progress in the dungeon. Foes won't move until you do. Open the menu with B and think before you act. That is a very good point. You want to. Th this game is very strategy based. Because of how the world's set up. Also, obtaining Pokemon in this game is a little different. As are some other aspects. Oh no, it's a Sunkern, the most powerful Pokemon in the world. I'm joking, by the way. I come to think of it, isn't Sunkern, in terms of stats, actually the weakest Pokemon in existence? Ow. Ow. Stop it. Bad Sunkern. <laughs> I say that it's the weakest Pokemon in existence and it starts beating me up. It's just like childhood, Cody. Give me your money. I'm kidding. Alright, so we have a... You're not the only one who has to do the battling. Your teammate will also engage in battle. Sometime in the near future, he will actually use an attack instead of just using Leer. So, it looks like the way this P these Pidgeys are is the way we want to go. And as you fight, as you can imagine, like from a normal Pokemon game, you'll gain experience. Oh! And when you get a certain amount, like in any other game, you will level up. I leveled up! The flame of my tail grew bigger, too. Our HP went up by three, our attack went up by two, our defense went up by two, our special attack went up by two, our special defense went up by two. Your team regains HP as it moves. Hold B, then A. Hold B, then press A to recover. To recover HP quickly on the spot. What they're telling you you can do is by holding B and pressing A, 
you can uh, get more uh, HP back, I think. I did it. I leveled up, and Trico also learned Absorb, meaning now Trico has other maneuvers it can do. Attack went up by three. HP went up by three, attack by, by two, defense up by two, and the same with all of his other stats. Now, but there's one other thing I want to talk about, and this is a mechanic I don't like. I don't like the belly. Basically, your Pokemon will start to get hungry as the dungeon progresses. So unless you pack enough food for the entire dungeon, which, unless you've been to the dungeon before, you have no idea how long it's going to be, you have, you will start to starve. And as you get hungrier, but we have the introduction of berries. A pet berry will hear any kind of poisoning. Open the menu with B and select it under items. This is we go over item. Right now, we can each only hold one item apiece. And if we eat this, it'll say nothing happened, but our belly also filled up by a bit. Here's what I want to get, though. An orange berry restores HP. Open the menu and select with B and select it under items. Now, unlike in normal games where orange berries only heal up 10, this game, they'll heal up 100. It's always a pretty much a full heal. So, unlike in normal games where orange berries suck all kinds of butt, here, I would highly recommend gathering as many as you can. Oh, this sucks. <sighs> Statuses also are slightly different in the game. You, can, If you fall asleep for a certain amount of time, you can't attack, and... Well, I guess that's not really different from the main game. Anyway, the first dungeon, being the easiest, it's only about three floors and easy enough. There's Caterpie. Mommy, where are you? We came to rescue you. Huh? Your mom's waiting. Let's get it. Let's get you out. Okay. My baby's safe. I'm sorry. I don't know how I could have ever. Th I don't know how I could ever thank you properly. Oh, that's okay. It's, it has been dangerous lately with sudden quakes and fissures like that one. It was great to find your little boy unharmed. Please, man, have your names at least. I'm Trico, and this is Cody. Cool. <laughs> He's uh, staring at me adoringly with sparkly eyes. It's a little embarrassing. And I'm a pretty boy. I'm kidding. That doesn't. But I don't. But this doesn't feel bad either. It's like I'm a hero. Helping Pokemon in trouble might be a good experience. Thank you, Trico and Cody. I know it isn't really enough, but please take this as a token of our thanks. Please accept it. Receive the promised orange berry. Let's receive the item Petcha Berry. The items also. The team also received the item Rost Berry. Thank you so much. Goodbye. Thank you for helping. You're very tough. Sh I, sh I was sure impressed. So, what are you going to do? Do you have any plans? Listen, Cody. If you don't have any place to stay, you should come with me. Well, this is the place. Wow. Like a Charmander Heaven. Wow! I can't explain, but I'm happy. I'm a human being, but in this place, I feel weirdly happy. It might be an instinct thing for a Pokemon. Maybe it's what it's like to, when you want to wag your tail. <laughs> it doesn't matter. I'm happy. Maybe I feel that way because I'm Charmander. Okay, Cody. Oh, Cody. You're impressed, aren't you? I thought so. I thought this would make a good place for you to live. I'm sure you'd like it. This is your mailbox. They deliver mail from Pokemon here. You know, just like the fissure Caterpie fell into. For some reason, there have been many natural disasters lately. Because of those disasters, many Pokemon are suffering. I want to help Pokemon in these tough times. I want to help change things so all the Pokemon can live in peace. So, uh, well, I like to, I like, I liked how you handled yourself when we rescued Caterpie. Would you join up? Would you join with? Would you like to join me on a rescue team? Cody, with you, I think we could become the world's best rescue team. How about it? You know what? Well, there's nothing else really we can do. I mean, we're stuck in a place with nowhere to go. And this Trico has been so kind to us. What else can I say but... Of course! Perfect. That's it then. We're partners in our rescue team from now on, Cody. Glad to have you on board. The team's name? Well, I don't have one yet. So, Cody, what do you think would be a good name for us? That 
is a very good question. And I think I know just the people who can answer it. Guys, within this game, there are a lot of options <laughs> that for naming things coming up. So... And the first of them is our team name. What do you guys think we should call our team? And that is where I'm going to end the video off here. Next time on Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, Blue Rescue Team, we're going to name our team. And we're going to proceed to the world we have arrived in. See you guys then.